D Marksman hosted the Brand of the Year felicitation ceremony in Delhi. This prestigious title is more than just an accolade. It's a testament to the relentless pursuit of excellence, innovation and integrity. Being named Brand of the Year signifies a brand's exceptional performance and unwavering commitment to quality and customer satisfaction. This honor recognizes companies that have not only excelled in their industries but have also set new benchmarks for others to aspire to. The Marksman's Brand of the Year represents a journey of dedication where companies have continually pushed the boundaries to deliver outstanding products and services. It is a recognition of their ability to build and maintain trust with their customers, showcasing their resilience and adaptability in an ever evolving marketplace. This award highlights the brands that have successfully navigated challenges, embraced change, and remained steadfast in their mission to provide unparalleled value. These brands have demonstrated that through innovation, quality, and a customer centric approach, they can achieve remarkable success and leave a lasting legacy. Join us as Team Marksman celebrates these trailblazing companies that have earned the title of Brand of the Year. Brought to you by Team Marksman and televised on India Today. The event was kicked off with a panel discussion on embracing customer centric engagement for brand excellence. Hey everybody, thank you for being here. Let's kick this off. We've got a power packed panel, as you can see, uh, and we'll dive right into it. Start with maybe a question for you, Deepthi and Pawan. We all have heard about how consumer attention spans are really, really low. How do you use methods for engaging and attracting them to your brand in a meaningful way? I think innovation in whatever you do is extremely important. So at Vistara, at least what we try and do is, one is if there is a campaign, how we can deliver it in an innovative way. So just to give you an example, uh, we finished eight years last year and uh, we actually drew a number eight in the sky. And that was done just for virality. People on the ground obviously cannot see it, but people who are tracking the flight on the flight radar can actually see the number eight being drawn by that aircraft. And it was just done to stand out. So innovation is, I think, very important. Uh, I think uh, I look at it a little differently. I think the fundamental question right now is, uh, how do you make uh, your brand part of consumers' daily lives? When it comes to Gen Z, uh, I think uh, if you want to target Gen Z, then you have to become part of their lives. So memes for most of the Gen Z have become part of their lives and you will have to sort of put your neck out and become part of, you know, those uh, memes. So I think, uh, you know, you have to make content for right people and you have to, you know, target right format and you have to make sure that you, for your audience, you are catering to their interests also. Next question. Uh for you, Shashank and uh, Abhin, could you share with us anecdotes and stories of how you've delivered personalization at scale using technology or otherwise? I can give you examples from automotive field, from where yeah. I come from. Uh, we have uh, about uh, we have data for about 2.5 crore uh, consumers, and uh, we have data on transactions for a long time, right. and now we are putting interactional data as well. There was this uh, girl whose father had bought Wagonar in 2006 and she was from Gargi College here in Delhi and we knew from our database that she would be passing out of college this year and when we approached her uh, for the new Wagonar and she said no my father owns a Wagonar I don't want to buy right. Wagonar so he said no this is the third generation of Wagonar she, we offered her a test drive and actually she is currently using that Wagonar so that, it would never have been possible without those analytic tools being available or without data being available. So, uh, really mesmerized by the conversation, Mr. Shashank. I am still not in complete agreement that attention span is less. What is happening that we see in the brand is brand as a promise, which we all studied, has moved to brand as an experience. So now what we are doing with, with not as much as Maruti data, we have around 
uh, 4 million customer data right of the years we are able to do it by family association of what is the corpus and there are very beautiful intricacies the father and mother who are now 70 year old want son to be the nominee but not daughter in law they want their son's kid to be the nominee so they are saying build a solution where we can give percentage of nominee allocation in our mutual fund so that's the change and personalization that we are fighting for the brand playback as we all know has been torn up and rewritten in recent years through resilience and quick thinking an elite cross section of brand builders have recognized these essential home truths and tempered their plan to stand the tough test that lie in this offering they deserve being recognized as a brand of the year 2024 and for the felicitation can i please request mr alok lal executive director and national head of advertising along with mr akash tiwari co-founder team marksman network to join us on stage for the felicitation <laughs> First up it's Fleet Guard Filters Private Limited My name is uh, Niranjan Kirloskar and I am the managing director of Fleet Guard Filters Private Limited See we are basically in the automotive segment again rather the commercial segment to so to say So we are not a fast moving consumer good therefore our brand is normally only known to let us say the oems or let's say the distributors or the mechanics or the retailers in the in operating in that particular segment what we envision is what we want to do and what the game changer that we are looking for is basically even a housewife should know the brand fleet guard or the brand filtrum that is what we want to do and we are thinking on those lines as to how we can do that like i don't watch saas bhi kabhi bahut hi or whatever that episterial is but still i know about it so that's the brand value that we want to create for the next in the next 5 years or so and i should thank team marksman for this because i came for this program today and i have been thinking how to what to do about the brand so that every indian knows about this brand irrespective of whether he is my customer or not today from this panel that i just heard before i came in here i've got a lot of ideas because they are from other fields completely which we had never thought about so being in this line for so many years we just have one focus area to think about now we can think out of the box so it has been a absolutely a useful uh exercise for us of being here congratulations up next we have meril life sciences private limited at meril leveraging data driven insights and predictive analytics is central to our strategy in anticipating and responding to the ever evolving patient needs and preferences as a research focused organization operating in the medical device sector particularly in orthopedics cardiovascular endosurgery diagnostics ent and surgical robotics we have integrated advanced analytics into our operational and strategic frameworks we rely on data which includes clinical trials market research and surgeon feedbacks this data help us understand patient outcomes practitioners needs and emerging trends in healthcare by integrating data driven insights and predictive analytics into our core operations meril not only participates and responds to shifting consumer trends but also drives innovation and excellence in the medical devices industry up next we have GM Modular Private Limited Yeah 
my name is Asim Kumar Kothiala. I am the director of international trade with GM Modular Private Limited. GM Modular was uh, incepted in 2002 and since then it has given a path making technology to the masses and the classes. We were the first ones to give a modular different plate on a switch which was never heard by anybody. Since then we've come out with home automation, we've got BLDC fans that are the need of the hour, we've got other products that we've introduced which are the best in the technology. Well, GM has a very strong R&D team and we focus a lot on the design and on the innovation that makes the product stand out and give the best in its class. And we now have come out with products that are more easy to use, they're advanced in technology, we are using the best possible methods that can bring out from the drawing board to the production floor the best product. So uh, today we have a basket of uh, switches, home automation, LED lighting, and then we have the fans, appliances, wires and cables and our team has already uh, started developing uh, uh, some futuristic product like our product, our product line basically the geysers, the iron boxers. Uh, then in the future we, we get into the kitchenware also. So that is a plan for the next two, three years. So basic target is that every household should have one GM item. Uh, this uh, three, four years, uh, the last three, four years, uh, there is a strong uh, uh, encouragement for Make in India. Uh, our Prime Minister Narendra Modi has been really kind enough to you know, initiate that. We, we are a good advocate of Make in India and uh, we are proud that uh, we, are, we are the largest company today, uh, manufacturing switches and all other, uh, other items also. Basically, while uh, any, any product which has to be designed, uh, there are a lot of uh, other things which goes uh, while designing the product. It's not basically just the concept. We also see that when we are making a product, it is very beautiful and it is also more functional to see it. And we, we have a very uh, big team for uh, you know, checking this, uh, uh, all of our quality products and all. We have a back-end big lab and uh, engineers, uh, uh, engineers from various uh, institutions and all. We have to know that when we are making a product in India, ke liye banate to, uh, we have to understand the mindset of the uh, people uh, down the line. There are architects involved in our business, there are builders and there are end users. If you go to global, I think we, we understand the requirement of that particular country and try to build up that product which is better than what is available or at least which is par with the technology that, and the standard that they have, the country have. So I think uh, we are able to you know, achieve this uh, with, a, with our team. We have around uh, more than 75,000 touch points, mm -hmm. the dealer network and all. Mm -hmm. And today, uh, I think uh, we are the largest uh, and the most admired brand in the country today. Up next, we have Super Shakti. The next brand of the year goes to Rupee Ready. My name is Ajay Kumar Charasya. I am the Vice President Marketing for uh, Rupi Redi. When I joined the company, we were only 32 people. Uh, we hardly had a presence in the market and today we are growing in numbers and, and then specifically getting this award at this point of time. I thank our team's marksmen to uh, appreciate us with this award and we hope that we would be continuing this spree for the coming years as well. Digital banking is uh, moving on very forward because all the banks are becoming digital now. A lot of banks have merged together to just to, you know, get into the fast-paced technology that is there. Every month you have a new fintechs coming in. While we are into specifically into a digital lending platform and we provide loans from via our platform. So in our case, uh, more important is how you are selling the story, how you are able to connect with the audience and what exactly are you trying to you know, solve the problem for them. So I think uh, based on our entire branding strategy that has been there for a year, we have always, always tried to uh, touch base the problems why people are taking loan. Where are we helping and how are we able to, you know, available for them at the time of servicing? And that's the strategy that we are working on from the last one year. Up next is Fenessa. <laughs> In 
Innovation is at the core of Finesta's brand strategy. As India's number one brand in windows and doors, uh, Finesta constantly strives to push boundaries uh, and introduces cutting edge solutions that enhance the customer's living and working environment. To communicate the innovative edge effectively, we leverage multiple channels. Our marketing campaign highlights the unique features and benefits of our products, showcasing real-time applications and customer testimonials. Additionally, we engage with our audience via digital as well as social media platforms, interactive demos like the AR, VR visualization tools, and informative content that educates and creates awareness about the advantages of our advanced technologies. For us, innovation is a continuous journey. It's about consistently delivering superior quality and performance, ensuring that customers enjoy the latest advancements of modern living. Up next, we have Cetaphil. Galdama is the pure play category leader in dermatology and we are committed to advancing dermatology for every skin story. Leveraging our unique 40 plus years heritage of leading science based innovation, we deliver a synergistic portfolio of flagship brands and services that span full spectrum of dermatology. Today's consumers pay close attention to their skincare needs in response to the changing lifestyle and increasing concerns about the effects of pollution, stress, UV damage, allergies, and aging skin. With Cetaphil, our aim is to provide consumers with innovative, science-based treatment to maintain healthy skin throughout their lives, from infancy to adulthood, across a spectrum of skincare goals. Cetaphil provides science-backed solutions. Our purpose drives us to create skincare products that cater to every skin story. With diverse consumer needs, whether it is hydration, acne protection, brightness, or simple cleansing. Cetaphil offers a broad range of products partnering with dermatologists designed to meet these needs while remaining truly gentle on sensitive skin. We have always been dedicated to fulfilling our promises last 25 plus years in India for medical practitioners, patients, as well as consumers and trade partners. Cetaphil's trusted reputation has played a significant role in our substantial growth in the Indian market. Year after year, we remain consistently dedicated to our mission. This trust is a key factor in our consumers' loyalty and their choice to incorporate Cetaphil into their daily skincare routine. We are deeply appreciative of our consumer for recognizing Cetaphil as brand of the year 2024 as well. With Cetaphil, over the years, we have developed and launched a wide range of products in the Indian market. For babies and their delicate skin, we have Cetaphil Baby, for even skin tone and brightness seekers with sensitive skin, we have Cetaphil Bright Healthy Radiance range. And most recently, we have Cetaphil Optimal Hydration for those who are seeking specialized skin hydration solution. Although these products address specific consumer needs, the focus remains on sensitive skin. As we study the Indian market, we understood that one in three consumers has sensitive skin. Yet, few brands offer specialized products for, for this need. Through Cetaphil, we partner with dermatologists to create formulations that provide effective results while remaining gentle on the skin. Each Cetaphil variant is developed to defend against five signs of skin sensitivity. For example, dryness, irritation, roughness, tightness, and a weakened skin barrier while delivering effective results. We have a robust pipeline of products to fuel the growth for the next five years and to meet consumer needs in the future. Once again, I would like to thank our consumers and at Cetaphil, we assure our consumers that hum skin ki sune, tum dil ki suno. And up next, we have uh, Vistara Tata Sia Airlines Limited. Up next, we have Nexon Paints. Bajaj Capital Insurance.
And with that, we come to the end of the Brand of the Year 2024 Felicitation Ceremony. Team Marksman celebrated excellence, innovation and the relentless pursuit of quality. Each brand honoured has demonstrated remarkable resilience, creativity and customer centricity, earning the trust and admiration of millions. Receiving the moniker of Brand of the Year is a testament to a brand's commitment to excellence and its impact on the market and society. These brands have set benchmarks in their respective industries, inspiring others to strive for greatness. They have not only met but exceeded expectations, driving forward the ideals of integrity, innovation and excellence. Team Marksman will return with more such felicitations in store as they celebrate those companies that have earned the title of Most Preferred Workplace. Until then, this has been Brand of the Year 2024, brought to you by Team Marksman and televised on India Today.